evolution is real and why haven't the humans did it because uh, they're dumber than they've ever been I mean if you're dumb enough to believe in a history book which everyone is so I'm just crazy right so I don't believe that the world is I, I don't even believe it's like uh, 40 years old I think it's like a shorter instance designed to make it look like it's a long instance because there's no fuck away I would trap someone on this fucking place if it was an actual game world It'd be fucking like a quick illusion and you'd have fucking people ready to stand by to inject you with some good ass drugs the second you came out of this world and shit. That way you don't start stabbing everyone in the fucking game lab. But evolution was real. How come the humans are devolving and they can't have their own thoughts and um, that's like promoted so evolution promotes pedophiles too because pedophiles control the everything apparently so um, you know they control the religions they control the science religion they control the atheist religion they probably control the satanists too but I mean actually the satanists are the ones you can talk the least shit about except for their it's kind of I guess it's, it's kind of like bottom line evolution to a take someone else's book and claim to be part of it when you claim to be against it it's just like no you erase it you don't you don't say I am you know the enemy of Zeus if you don't believe in Zeus you don't say you're like the guy you're Hades I don't believe in Zeus but because I'm Hades it's like well, you're a fucking retard that's what it sounds like so fucking you know no offense to retarded people because they actually have an excuse for who they are. Um, and I guess the same excuse everyone else probably has is the game system fucking has auto-generated them that way. So it's, uh, it's really the only excuse I see for the, the de-evolution and all that stuff is that, um, that uh, the game is just auto-generating people. So there is... Uh, you know, no excuse. Uh, when they when they only can emulate three out of seven emotions and they can't do that fully, then it's like, okay, well, yeah. I mean, it, it's obviously like I don't I don't know. Is that evolution? Maybe maybe humans only said only know one one feeling, and they could only uh, emulate like three sects of the nine key components of that emotion. Who knows, maybe it used to be much worse, right? You know, humans used to be like... Like, the trees used to look over humans and go, You guys are really dumb. Yeah, I'm going to cut me up and make some books out of me so you can become smart, right? Trees probably used to say that. And they're like, Oh, thank you, trees, for blessing us with knowledge. And now they hate the trees and want to get rid of them. They don't want to, they do. That's what all the concrete here is for. But, um, yeah, how is that? How does that evolution work out? If, um, okay, so l let's look at it this way. Right now, like, China has been at war with people for, like, supposedly thousands of years. So let's go with this mythological freaking dragons and princess fairy tale that this world's like thousands of years old so for thousands of years old these certain groups of people have been trying to kill off the yellow people and um they haven't been able to do it right so they they maybe what they should have did is they should have simply went to them and said hey for your health kill yourself and they would do it because and tell you sometime march in 2020 people just like all of a sudden by 11 a.m. for their health they started killing each other off for, and I mean that's a good argument like if you're gonna like come with that argument kill yourself for the planet's health for your health kill yourself like that's a you know I like honesty like hey hey let's discuss this topic enslave yourself for our health was it even even South Africa, if you believe, 
the world is thousands of years old. Even the South Africans, you know, the people, everyone here uh, calls all sorts of names. I can't, I can't, I can't repeat what all the other people around me say, or I'll get banned. But, uh, you know, other than that, I make a little joke about, you know, the people uh, uh, in South Africa. Or, I, I mean, they don't even, those people probably aren't even in South Africa anymore. They're probably killed off and brought over to different places. But, like, I, I really doubt, like, by 11 a.m., by the time the Mayflower arrived to uh, South Africa, the black people were on their knees begging to be uh, put in chains and have their heads chopped off. You know, so we've evolved from, you know, yellow people fighting uh, other groups for like thousands of years trying to take over their land. And, um, I mean, they're still doing that for some reason. They're still doing that today, though. Uh, they're still not letting USA or anyone else come into their nation and kill them and take everything from them. Um, but then all of a sudden, 11 a.m., March... 2020, by 11 a.m., everything changed. And people just, like, they became slaves all of a sudden. They just did it. Because it's for your health. Because science, because the new religion, the new god of the world, said it. The new religion. Same as the old religion. Same groups running it. It just, they're handing the torch off. Christianity... Too many people started questioning Christianity. They were like, but I've never seen Jesus. And after 2,000 years of 20 billion people saying, but I've never seen Jesus, they evolved. And they were like, oh, oh, we need something else to, uh, to tell these people. And so then they're like, Adam, there's an Adam in this world. And, and, and then, um, what else? What else is the funk core? Oh, the, the Big Bang Theory that was pushed by the Catholics. Yeah, so that's... They just, they're just stealing ideas from the Christians and Catholics. And uh, I guess evolution is, uh, is hard. And you can't see it when the group you just questioned for 2,000 years whether their stories of invisible people were real or not. Um, you question them and then they just, you know, call it something else. And you're like, oh, that's a better one. There's an invisible guy called Adams. There's an invisible Adams in the world. And, and technically the name Adam is pretty much the name Adam. So uh, it's it's not even like, it, he's not even changed it. I, I don't know. It took me a minute to like actually figure that one out there myself. But the rest of it, I don't know. I, I was busy being indoctrinated by that stuff because we were all so evolved that uh, like whatever the TV said was real. Although like 40 years ago, I was told that TV wasn't real, but now everything on TV is is real. TV is bad as of like a couple of years ago, but the internet is great because it's a TV that is uh, called a monitor instead of a TV. So you just change the name from TV to monitor and magically uh, it's real. Even though there's even more crazy stuff on there. Terminators and Smurfs have evolved into something even more crazy, less believable than they were before. Evolution's really worked. You know, we went from um, uh, toasters that toast toast to toasters that toast bagels. So we've had like 20 billion years of evolution to make wide space toasters. And, you know, you could make the argument, too, that six, that those old toasters 60 years ago actually worked and didn't break, and these new ones break. So how, how evolved are they? But um, if you look at the human race, it's weeded out people who can think for themselves. So evolution does not include people who can think for themselves. It's uh, weeded out people who uh, 
don't want to have sex with children, apparently, because there's not many of them left on the planet. And, you know, my argument used to be, like, uh, why would I want to have sex with, like, a young person? Even when I was young, it's like, God, they're stupid, aren't they? But then I got older, and I, I was like, oh, they're all... They actually don't learn anything, do they? They're kind of... You're kind of born who you are, and you kind of remain that for a long time. It's like, I wasn't... I wasn't, like, born dumb, and then I magically had these thoughts and stuff. It's like I was born an adult, and then I magically grew up and got big enough to fucking defend myself from the savages around me. Although, there's 20 million of them working against me at this point. Um, 7.29. Yeah, I mean, the only evolution I really did was growing up to be big enough to defend myself from these people. And then and then I quickly learned that they're all out working together against me. They've got their armies and shit and their fucking soldiers of their Nazi soldiers. I don't like that word Nazi because they're like, oh, that's white supremacy. It's like, oh, I mean, this nation isn't just white people. It's a whole bunch of different colored Nazis. Like they all believe in, in their supremacy. They believe in Babylonian supremacy. That's what they believe in. I guess, supposedly I'm supposed to believe when you're a slave for long enough, you're conditioned. And it's like, that kind of didn't just happen either, right? There was like a a period there where I was told that the slaves were upset and they weren't conditioned. And then now all of a sudden they are conditioned. Kind of just like 11 a.m. the next day, everyone uh, understood all this magical science stuff even though they would still fail science tests if they were given science tests but now they know everything about science uh, by 11 a.m. the next day everything about science and health and what's good for you and what's not and it's like that's not evolution when and that's not learning either when by 11 a.m. Someone can tell you some whole rundown of some stuff they not all of them even seen on TV. That's like the software. That's like their brains being updated or something. Uh, especially when you compare it to the fact that they've had like 12 years of schooling and they don't remember any of that and they didn't remember any of it when they were in there either. I can understand the excuse you forget that stuff or it gets filed away, but they after 12 years they didn't understand any of that so so like where is this real evolution happening where is this this revolution and evolution and all this stuff this is nonsense why do i even waste my time talking like it's it's like fuck like i don't want to talk anymore i'm being forced to like i don't want to be around people ever again i never wanted to it's like you know, the bottom line question is, like, who the fuck forced me in this world and are they prepared for me to chop their head off when I fucking find them? Because that is, like, really, like, you know, six hours a day of thought has to be dedicated to that. And that's evolution when we find what has created this world and we destroy it. Whether, you know, if it's on a computer system, which is likely the case, when I wake up from this thing, I'm going to evolve the system by destroying it. I'm just going to set the computer on fire, throw it out the window. They'll probably have, like, some special safety glass windows and used to people like me waking up from this shit and, um, like, going a little schizo. Like, they kind of showed that in the movie Total Recall. Like, like the people sometimes wake up from the simulation fucking going, going haywire. It makes sense. Why wouldn't you? Fucking... Yeah, like... The evolution... I'd like you guys to show me where that's at. Ooh, there's a... Ooh, an electric car... That no one I've ever met could even afford... Or could begin to explain to me how it works. And I don't think most people who can afford those... Can explain how they work... Even half the extent I can. But of course, that's fake too. Like the whole science cult is fake. I mean, the science cult is the one... Telling us that... Uh, becoming pedophiles 
Uh, I, uh, you know, there's more I could say, like pedophiles who like young boys. Let's let's put it that way, because I can't offend them. I can't offend the mass population and what they've evolved into. So, right right now, they're still like hiding that they're pedophiles, but they're not hiding that they like little boys or they like boys. So, I can't I can't like you know defame that culture of uh, you know boys liking littler boys because it's it's that's evolution right that's evolution me being censored and and not able to talk about that. that's human evolution there is to become pedophile robots I uh, can't even emulate seven emotions properly can't even uh, emulate the three emotions they generally have properly and uh, to a full array it's like, it's fucking evolution, dude. It's great. I love it. I love this society. I love how they lock me out. And at the end of the day, fucking, you know, I'm pretty sure this has just been a war zone. This is a game. And because I wouldn't allow myself into a world like this. It, like, this would be a boring as shit virtual world. Like, where just, like, everyone is fucking retarded and pedophiles and stuff. So um, I'm pretty sure like with 2020, it's evolving into a war zone because I mean, these are the mass murderers. They're the ones forcing people to wear masks to suffocate them. They're the ones walking on fucking, fucking concrete they built by fucking killing other people and stealing their shit from them. So like, I mean, this is just like where it leads to, right? And that's why I'm the different one because I'm actually like the one who fucking understands it and does something about it, right? But, um, I don't know. I think, uh, I I was thinking towards 2020, like, let them fucking kill us. I'll don't, and stop fighting it. Like, what am I going to do? Run for president and and fucking save them from what they've been doing to me along with other people? That's fucking retarded. Why would I do that? Like, why would I protect the people who just fucking enslaved me in 2020? Like, I mean, technically it's since 1984, when I had first thought when the world began, I believe. But um, why, why would I do that? Why would I, like, fight to protect those people uh, if they're, like, all involved? I mean, they're not even, like, I don't like this word, word people anymore because there's obviously different levels of what the AI allows to be generated as uh, the characters in the game. So... Like, I, I mean, we should start classifying the different levels of host or NPCs and, and find out if there's actually other living players in this game. But, yeah, like, that would be evolution to me, start classifying people like that and start questioning why evolution is actually not happening. 